I think the best thing to do with the, in anti-corruption fight is to go for asset recovery. If we can go for asset recovery and just recover the assets that, that have been acquired by people who have stolen massive amounts of money, then that can be a major step in the fight against corruption. But we should know that the fight against corruption is for all of us. That's why we're telling the deputy governor, people should take responsibility of their own department. When you realize there's something going on in your own department, you should take charge. Like I've always said, when you have some people in the county who have amassed wealth and, and explained wealth, you can just take, you, as a person, you can take charge and even report to the relevant agencies that this person has, has, an, has an amount of money which cannot be explained. Because it's so easy to trace what you have. If you, you came to the county with a small bicycle and within a year or two you are driving the top of the range, range rover of 20 million, the deputy governor can, and or the CEC can say, how did you acquire this? If you count your amount, the salary you get, the allowances you get, the per diems you get versus what you own, that is what the, the commission is going to go after. We are going to asset recovery and we are going to go to recover massive, massive assets on behalf of the government.